Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. People are waiting for a bus at a bus stop. B. A group of people is playing soccer in a park. C. A man is reading a newspaper in a cafe. D. A man is writing in a notebook while sitting on a bench. The correct answer is D. A man is writing in a notebook while sitting on a bench. Number 2. A. A group of students is walking down the hallway. B. A teacher is handing out books to students. C. A man is writing mathematical equations on a blackboard. D. A woman is giving a presentation in an auditorium. The correct answer is C. A man is writing mathematical equations on a blackboard. Number 3. A. Two people are sitting on a bench in a garden. B. A group of people is attending a business meeting. C. Several people are jogging along the beach. D. A man is reading a book in a park. The correct answer is B. A group of people is attending a business meeting. Number 4. A. A man is typing on a laptop while a woman is observing. B. Two co workers are discussing a project at a desk. C. A group of people is attending a meeting in a conference room. D. A man is giving a presentation to a group. The correct answer is A. A man is typing on a laptop while a woman is observing. Number 5. A. People are standing in a queue at a bus stop. B. A woman is typing on a laptop. C. A man is preparing a presentation in an office. D. A man is serving food at a counter. The correct answer is D. A man is serving food at a counter. Number 6. A. A person is giving a presentation in a conference room. B. Several people are cooking in a kitchen. C. Two people are riding bicycles in a park. D. A man is reading a book in a garden. The correct answer is A. A person is giving a presentation in a conference room. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Do you think it will rain today? A. Yes, I brought my raincoat. B. I don't have my umbrella. C. No, it's sunny right now. The correct answer is C. No, it's sunny right now. Number 2. Have you finished the annual report? A. Yes, just completed it. B. I'm still working on it. C. No, I need more time. The correct answer is A. Yes, just completed it. Number 3. Why were you late for the meeting? A. I had a doctor's appointment. B. The meeting was cancelled. C. I'm always on time. The correct answer is A. I had a doctor's appointment. Number 4. Why is the office so cold today? A. I prefer it cooler. B. It feels normal to me. C. The heating system is under repair. The correct answer is C. The heating system is under repair. Number 5. Did you complete the report? A. The meeting is at 3 p.m. B. No, this computer is mine. C. Yes, I finished it last night.
The correct answer is C. Yes, I finished it last night. Number 6. Why was the presentation postponed? A. It is about the new project. B. The presenter was sick. C. I enjoyed the presentation. The correct answer is B. The presenter was sick. Number 7. What is the address of the new office? A. It's near the subway. B. On Friday. C. 123 Main Street. The correct answer is C. 123 Main Street. Number 8. What's the status of the project? A. We're on schedule. B. I prefer coffee. C. We need more materials. The correct answer is A. We're on schedule. Number 9. Will the package arrive by Friday? A. Yes, it will be delivered by then. B. The package is heavy. C. I ordered it yesterday. The correct answer is A. Yes, it will be delivered by then. Number 10. How do I operate this machine? A. It should be delivered soon. B. Please read the manual first. C. I can show you later. The correct answer is B. Please read the manual first. Number 11. What type of documents are required? A. Follow the instructions. B. Submit it by email. C. A valid ID and application form. The correct answer is C. A valid ID and application form. Number 12. Do you know where she lives? A. No, she just moved. B. Yes, she lives near the park. C. I don't have her phone number. The correct answer is B. Yes, she lives near the park. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. Are you free to review the project timeline this afternoon? Yes, I have some time after 2 p.m. Perfect. Let's meet at 2.30 in the project room. I'll be there. At what time will they meet? A. At 2.30 p.m. B. At 2 p.m. C. At 3 p.m. The correct answer is A. At 2.30 p.m. Number 2. Have you finished designing the new brochure? Yes, I just sent it to your email for review. Excellent. I'll take a look and get back to you by tomorrow. Perfect. Thank you. When will the man review the brochure? A. Tomorrow. B. Today. C. Next week. The correct answer is A. Tomorrow. Number 3. I've booked the venue for our annual event. That's excellent. Have we sent out the invitations yet? Not yet. I'll do that first thing tomorrow morning. Great. Let me know if you need any help. When will the invitations be sent out? A. This evening. B. Tomorrow morning. C. Next week. The correct answer is B. Tomorrow morning. Number 4. I need to book a flight to New York for the client meeting. Do you have a preference for the airline? No preference, just the earliest flight available. I'll check the schedules and book it right away. What is the man's main concern for booking the flight? A. The airline. B. The earliest flight. C. The cost. The correct answer is B. The earliest flight. Number 5. I need to arrange a service appointment for my car. Do you want to do it during lunchtime? That's a good idea. I'll call the service center now. 
Let me know if you need a ride there. When will she call the service center? A. In the morning. B. In the afternoon. C. During lunchtime. The correct answer is C. During lunchtime. Number six. Could you review the financial report before our meeting tomorrow? Sure. I'll look it over tonight and give you my feedback. Excellent. Thanks for your help. No problem at all. When will the woman review the report? A. Tomorrow morning. B. During the meeting. C. Tonight. The correct answer is C. Tonight. Number seven. Our lunch with the new clients is set for Friday. What time are we meeting them? 12 p.m. at the downtown restaurant. Got it. I'll mark my calendar. When is the lunch meeting? A. On Wednesday. B. On Friday. C. On Monday. The correct answer is B. On Friday. Number 8. Are we still on for lunch today? Yes, I reserved a table at the Italian restaurant for 12.30 p.m. Wonderful. I've been craving pasta. Me too. I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait. Where will they have lunch? A. French Bistro. B. Italian Restaurant. C. Japanese Restaurant. The correct answer is B. Italian Restaurant. Number 9. Did you send the quarterly report to the clients? Yes, I emailed it to them yesterday. Great. Did you include the sales forecast? Yes, it's in the final section of the report. When was the quarterly report sent? A. Today. B. Yesterday. C. Last week. The correct answer is B. Yesterday. Number 10. We need to arrange a business trip for next week. Where are we going? We'll be visiting our office in Chicago. Okay, I'll book the flights and hotel today. Where will they be traveling? A. New York. B. Chicago. C. San Francisco. The correct answer is B. Chicago. Number 11. I need you to review these documents before the client meeting. Sure, when is the meeting? It's scheduled for 10 a.m. tomorrow. Okay, I'll review them this afternoon. When will the meeting with the client take place? A. At 10 a.m. today. B. At 10 a.m. tomorrow. C. At 3 p.m. today. The correct answer is B. At 10 a.m. tomorrow. Number 12. I'm having trouble with my laptop. Can you help? Sure. What's the issue? It won't connect to the Wi-Fi. Let me take a look. Maybe it's a settings problem. What is the man's problem? A. He can't connect to the Wi-Fi. B. His laptop is broken. C. He can't send emails. The correct answer is A. He can't connect to the Wi-Fi. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Attention shoppers. Our summer sale starts today. All clothing items are 20% off, and select electronics are up to 50% off. Don't miss our special promotions happening throughout the day. Visit our customer service desk for more details. What is the discount on clothing items? A. 20%. B. 30%, C, 10%. The correct answer is B, 20%. Number 2. The company's annual conference will be held virtually this year due to ongoing health concerns. Attendees can join sessions online, participate in live Q&A, and network via the conference platform. Registration is open until the end of this month. We look forward to an engaging and productive event. Why is the conference being held virtually? A. Speaker availability. B. Location issues. C. Health concerns.
The correct answer is A. Health concerns. Number 3. We are excited to announce that our new product line will be launched next Monday at 1 p.m. Join us for the launch event where we will showcase the new features and improvements. Refreshments will be served, and there will be a Q&A session afterwards. What is happening next Monday at 1 p.m.? A. A quarterly review meeting. B. A team-building workshop. C. A new product line is being launched. The correct answer is B. A new product line is being launched. Number 4. Our annual charity run will be held next month. Registration begins at 7 a.m. and the race starts at 8 a.m. All proceeds will go towards funding local community projects. Participants are encouraged to arrive early to pick up their race bibs. What time does the race start? A. 8 a.m. B. 7 a.m. C. 9 a.m. The correct answer is A. 8 a.m. Number 5. For your convenience, we now offer same-day delivery for all online grocery orders. Just place your order before 12 p.m. and receive your items before 8 p.m. the same day. Delivery slots are subject to availability. By what time should orders be placed for same-day delivery? A. 2 p.m. B. 10 a.m. C. 12 p.m. The correct answer is C. 12 p.m. Number 6. Please pay attention to our new recycling program. We now separate paper, plastic, and glass. Recycling bins are clearly labeled and located throughout the building. Always check the labels before disposing of waste to ensure proper recycling. What are the materials that should be separated? A. Paper, plastic, and glass. B. Metal, fabric, and food. C. Plastic, wood, and metal. The correct answer is B. Paper, plastic, and glass. Number 7. Attention shoppers! Our store is having a big sale this weekend with discounts up to 50% off. The sale includes items from all departments. Come early to catch the best deals. Thank you for choosing to shop with us. What is the maximum discount available during the sale? A. 50%. B. 40%. C. 30%. The correct answer is C. 50%. Number 8. Good morning, employees. We will be conducting a software update tonight during off-peak hours. Please save all work and log off your computers by 6 p.m. The update is essential to improve system performance and security. What time should employees log off their computers? A. After the update. B. By 6 p.m. C. At 5 p.m. The correct answer is C. By 6 p.m. Number 9. We are excited to announce the launch of our new mobile app. With this app, customers can easily track their orders, access exclusive deals, and get real-time customer support. Download it today from the App Store or Google Play. What is one feature of the new mobile app? A. Play games. B. Track orders. C. Shop online. The correct answer is B. Track orders. Number 10. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard. Please ensure that your seatbelt is fastened while seated. In case of an emergency, follow the illuminated exit signs and listen to crew instructions. Enjoy your flight with us. What should passengers do in an emergency? A. Call for help. B. Stay calm and seated. C. Follow the illuminated exit signs. The correct answer is A. Follow the illuminated exit signs. Number 11. 
Good morning, employees. Our company picnic is scheduled for next Saturday at Lakeside Park. Bring your families and enjoy a day of fun and relaxation. Games, food, and prizes will be available for all. Where will the company picnic be held? A. Lakeside Park. B. City Park. C. Riverside Park. The correct answer is C. Lakeside Park. Number 12. Our cooking class schedule for this summer includes special sessions on vegetarian cooking, baking, and international cuisine. Classes will be held every Saturday afternoon from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. Don't forget to register in advance as spots fill up quickly. When are the cooking classes being held? A. Every Sunday from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. B. Every Friday from 1 p.m. to 3 p.m. C. Every Saturday from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. The correct answer is A. Every Saturday from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin! Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, he finished the report when I called him. A, has, B, had, C, was, D, is. The correct answer is B, had. Number two, the high costs. The company decided to invest in new technology. A, in spite of, B, Despite, C. Because of, D. Although. The correct answer is B. Despite. Number three. She. The report when the phone rang. A. Wrote. B. Was writing. C. Writes. D. Will write. The correct answer is B. Was writing. Number four. The offices. The twelfth floor. A. In. B. On. C. By. D. At. The correct answer is B. On. Number five. They have been working here. Five years. A. For. B. In. C. During. D. Since. The correct answer is A. For. Number six. We will meet. 10 like a.m. tomorrow. A. On. B. At. C. By. D. In. The correct answer is B. At. Number 7. The manager. The report by the time you arrive. A. Finishes. B. Has finished. C. Was finishing. D. Will have finished. The correct answer is D. Will have finished. Number 8. The project is delayed. Lack of resources. A. Without. B. In spite of. C. Because of. D. For. The correct answer is. C. Because of. Number 9. She is capable. Managing multiple projects at once. A. In. B. With. C. Of. D. For. The correct answer is C. Of. Number 10. 
She regrets. The meeting without finishing her presentation. A. Leaving. B. Leave. C. To leave. D. Left. The correct answer is A. Leaving. Number 11. She worked hard. Achieving her goals. A. With. B. For. C. In. D. To. The correct answer is B. For. Number 12. He is interested. Learning more about the new software. A. On. B. To. C. In. D. At. The correct answer is C. In. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Attention. All employees must. Their ID badges at all. Hey. At all times, while on company premises, thank you, security department. A. Wear. B. Worn. C. Wearing. D. Wears. The correct answer is A. Wear. Number 2. Attention, all staff. As we move into the new fiscal year, it is crucial that all expense reports be. Please ensure that your reports are accurate and submitted on time. Regards Finance Department, Finance. A. Submit. B. Submitted. C. Submitting. D. Submitter. The correct answer is B. Submitted. Number 3. Our office will be closed for renovation next week. Please make necessary arrangements to work from home. A. During. B. At. C. For. D. To. The correct answer is A. During. Number 4. Due to unforeseen circumstances, the meeting postponed until further notice. A. Were. B. Is. C. Was. D. R. The correct answer is B. Is. Number 5. Hi team, please ensure that all files are incorrectly before the end of day deadline. Thanks, project manager. A. Submitting. B. Submitted. C. Submit. D. Submits. The correct answer is B. Submitted. Number 6. Dear all, please ensure that your project updates are by the end of the week. If you have any issues, contact your supervisor. Best, team lead. A. Submitting. B. Submits. C. Submit. D. Submitted. The correct answer is D. Submitted. And finally, Part 7, Reading, Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Hello everyone. We are introducing a new remote work policy, effective immediately. Employees may now work from home, up to three days a week, subject to manager approval. Detailed guidelines will be shared soon. Thank you, the management. What is the key update in the email? A. Launch of a mentoring program. B. Introduction of a remote work policy. C. Change in office location. The correct answer is B. Introduction of a remote work policy. Number 2. Notice to residents. Starting next Monday, our building will undergo exterior painting. The work is expected to last for two weeks. We apologize for any inconvenience and thank you for your cooperation. What will happen starting next Monday? A. Elevator maintenance. B. New security measures. C. 
building will undergo exterior painting. The correct answer is C. Building will undergo exterior painting. Number 3. We are pleased to inform you that the annual shareholders meeting will take place on November 25th at 10 a.m. in the main conference hall. Attendance is highly encouraged as we will be discussing the company's future plans and financial performance. Please RSVP by November 20th. What is the purpose of this announcement? A. To notify about a meeting. B. To introduce new shareholders. C. To announce a company closure. The correct answer is A. To notify about a meeting. Number 4. Attention. The fitness center will be closed for renovations starting this Monday and will reopen next Friday. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause and thank you for your patience. Regards, management. What is the reason for the closure of the fitness center? A. It is permanently closing. B. It is relocating. C. It is being renovated. The correct answer is C. It is being renovated. Number 5. Dear team, due to unforeseen circumstances, our scheduled meeting for this Friday has been postponed to next Tuesday at 10 a.m. Please adjust your calendars accordingly. Thank you for your flexibility. Best regards, HR Department. Why was this email sent? A. To confirm the meeting. B. To cancel the meeting. C. To announce a change in meeting time. The correct answer is C. To announce a change in meeting time. Number 6. Dear valued customers, we are thrilled to announce the launch of our latest product, the Smart Home Security System. To celebrate, we are offering a 10% discount on all pre-orders made this month. Visit our website to learn more and place your order today. What is the purpose of the announcement? A. To announce a new product launch. B. To announce a sale. C. To announce a website update. The correct answer is A. To announce a store closure. Number 7. Attention residents. The water supply will be interrupted on Saturday, August 12th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. due to maintenance work. Please store enough water for your needs during this period. We apologize for any inconvenience. Best regards, maintenance team. Why will the water supply be interrupted? A. Due to maintenance work. B. Due to a holiday event. C. Due to an inspection. The correct answer is A. Due to maintenance work. Number 8. We are introducing a new flexible working policy starting next quarter. Employees will be allowed to choose between working remotely or from the office based on their preferences. We believe this will enhance job satisfaction and productivity. What is being introduced? A. Office relocation. B. Flexible working policy. C. Remote working only. The correct answer is B. Flexible working policy. Number 9. Attention passengers. Due to extreme weather conditions, Flight 123 to New York has been delayed by three hours. The new departure time is 6 p.m. We advise passengers to stay updated for further announcements. We apologize for the inconvenience caused. What is the new departure time for Flight 1023? A. 3 p.m. B. 6 p.m. C. 9 p.m. The correct answer is B. 6 p.m. Number 10. Dear shareholders, we are pleased to report that our annual revenue has exceeded projections by 15%. This success is attributed to our new product launches and expanded market reach. We will continue to drive innovation and growth in the coming year. Thank you for your continued support. Sincerely, the Board of Directors. What is the key achievement mentioned in the report? A. 
the company held a large event. B. The annual revenue exceeded projections. C. A new CEO has been appointed. The correct answer is B. The annual revenue exceeded projections. Number 11. We are pleased to announce that our company has received the Best Customer Service Award for the third consecutive year. This achievement would not have been possible without the dedication and hard work of our team. Thank you for your continued support. What award did the company receive? A. Best Marketing Campaign B. Best Customer Service Award C. Top Sales Award The correct answer is B. Best Innovation Award. Number 12. To all employees, starting next month, the company will implement a new flexible working hours policy. This change aims to provide better work life balance and improve productivity. More details will be shared in the upcoming staff meeting. What is the reason for implementing the new policy? A. To provide better work life balance. B. To reduce employee wages. C. To extend working hours. The correct answer is A. To increase office space. Number 13. Our team is thrilled to announce a synergy meeting set for Thursday, October 10th at 3 p.m. in Conference Room B. We will discuss the strategic plan for the upcoming quarter with an emphasis on achieving our sales targets. Refreshments will be provided. We look forward to your active participation. What is the purpose of the meeting? A. To discuss sales strategies. B. To announce a merger. C. To plan a team outing. The correct answer is A. To discuss sales strategies. Number 14. 2. All staff. Subject. Fire drill. Notification. There will be a fire drill next Wednesday at 2 p.m. Please familiarize yourself with the evacuation routes and assembly points. Your participation is mandatory, safety officer. When is the scheduled fire drill? A. Friday afternoon. B. Tomorrow morning. C. Next Wednesday at 2 p.m. The correct answer is C. Next Monday at noon. Number 15. Attention. All employees due to maintenance work, the building's air conditioning system will be turned off for repairs this Saturday from 8 and key a.m. to 5 and 8 p.m. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause, and we appreciate your understanding. Facilities management. Why will the air conditioning be turned off? A. For maintenance work. B. To reduce energy costs. C. To upgrade to a new system. The correct answer is A. For maintenance work. Number 16. Hello, team. Please be advised that our quarterly meeting has been rescheduled to Friday, October 20th at 2 p.m. The venue remains the same. The main conference room. Ensure to mark your calendars accordingly. Regards. HR Department. What is the new date for the quarterly meeting? A. October 22nd. B. October 20th. C. October 15th. The correct answer is B. October 20th. Number 17. Attention shoppers. Our annual summer clearance sale is now on. Get up to 70% off on select items in store and online. Don't miss these incredible savings. Visit us today and refresh your wardrobe. Best. The store team. What is the purpose of this announcement? A. To announce a new store opening. B. To inform about a summer clearance sale. C. To advertise a new product. The correct answer is B. To inform about a summer clearance sale. Number 18. Dear Patrons, Please note that our library will be closed for inventory checks from December 10th 
to December 12th. We appreciate your patience and apologize for any inconvenience. Thank you, library staff. Why will the library be closed? A. For renovations. B. For inventory checks. C. For staff training. The correct answer is B. For inventory checks.